If I am the native of this place, I was married to part time Kumar Mandal. Mm. Then he stayed. My husband was in Kuchin, in a school, private school, management school. So we shifted there, and we were living there. After twenty twenty three years, we came back to this village. Okay. Actually, I am not coming to my own village. We were <laughs> seeking a place near Peria River, and fortunately, we got this place near Thanjavur. And the main important place, you know, this is the Peria River and Thanjavur Temple. And actually, it was not known as Thanjavur Temple. It was known as Krishna Temple. Okay. Thanks. And after the astrologers find it out that it is a Thanjavur Temple, and now it is known as Thanjavur Temple. Before that, if people are come here before uh, about twenty five years ago, they will say only that it is Krishna Temple. Mm -hmm. They don't know that it is Thanjavur Temple. Mm -hmm. So after only after that, you know that. And when Malayalam Ramachandra knew that Malayalam Ramachandra is uh, said to be an aesthetic, aesthetic, but, uh, aesthetic. Oh. But, but he always said that he worships Tottwa Tayavar. Oh. Then Tottwa Tayavar was supposed to be Krishna. Okay. And when he knew that it is Thanjavuri, okay. he wanted to. Write a novel on Thanjavuri Gram. Oh. That is Thanjavuri village of Thanjavuri. Oh. Uh, Thanjavuri has a village. This village. Oh. Because all the property belong to that temple. Oh. Okay. And uh, by land reform act and all that, we all got these places. So okay. it was actually the property of the temple. So Malayalam Ramachandra wanted to write a novel on Thanjavuri Gram. Okay. In his um, Last, last but one book, or magalode alba mm. in Malayalam. Okay. He wrote about it. He wanted to write a novel on Thanjavur Gram, and he will be coming and staying in his ancestral home and writing the novel. And it will be his last novel. And so many dreams of him, but it was not <laughs> done. It was okay. not but. So. It was incomplete work. Yes, yes. Yeah, no, even if uh, he had only an idea, and we supported it very much because we are also interested in it. Okay. And when we bought this, uh, he thought that we will be demolishing it and making a concrete building here. And when my husband said that we will never demolish it, we will preserve it, he was very happy. And uh, his. Autobiographical novel *Veerugal*, which is translated into Tamil and English and so many other languages also, it was taken as a film, okay. uh, not film, serial in the TV. *Veerugal*, oh. oh. and it was uh, the shooting was here, oh. in the original form. Okay. So this hanging court and everything you can see in that serial *Veerugal*, oh. okay. and uh, that *Veerugal* got the award for that year. Oh. I think it was in nineteen ninety-six oh, or so. Okay, okay. The best serial mm -hmm. for that year. And but he could not come here and stay here. But it was his last dream, which was not. <laughs> okay. But and we when when we bought it and we said that we bought it from his uh, nephew. His sister's son. Mm -hmm. He had uh, got two uh, daughters, and they were married at Bombay. So the daughters were married and settled at Bombay. Mm -hmm. So he wanted naturally he wanted to send it. So when we were <laughs> searching for a place near Peria, mm -hmm. we came here. Mm -hmm. My husband was a Malayalam teacher mm -hmm. at Kochi. And uh, we had a small house there, mm -hmm. and uh, we are very happy that we came here because compared to that house, it is a uh, really a what shall I say, a very big house. Mm -hmm. And uh, again, the native peoples are very cooperative. No, no strength, no quarrels, nothing. 
been incorporated into it. And all the people of all the caste and all the religion worship this God, Pandandiri God. In olden days, other people were not allowed to enter into the temple because it belonged to a family. It is a family temple, even now. In olden days, people were not allowed to enter into the temple. Even then, people worshipped from outside, outside the temple. And now, all people are allowed, allowed to enter in a tent. There is a feast at every now and then in the temple where all people can come and share and all that. And now it has become very famous because of the, it was recognized as Adnandari. And when it was recognized as Adnandari, it was very popular. It became very popular. Then again the astrologer searched for it again. Then they said that it was actually a temple of goddess, goddess Devi, Annapurnaishwari. Mm -hmm. So Annandari is sad because Annapurnaishwari is not given proper place in the temple. Mm -hmm. So a shrine for Annapurnaishwari also started there. And you see that Devi in the temple, that small one, it is newly built. And also a Dharma Shastra. Shasta, uh, Prabha and Satyaga. Shasta, Shasta's wife, Prabha and Satyaga, mm -hmm. the Magai, but son of. Mm -hmm. So it is very it's not. not Ayyapan? Yes, it is Shasta. It is not actually Ayyapan, it is Shasta. Mm -hmm. you know, that Vignesha, Ranavati was already there mm -hmm. even before. Mm -hmm. Now it has become more uh, popular and uh, more public also. Mm -hmm. Every people come here and cooperate and all that. Yes. Then, then you want to know about Pani Illam. Pani Illam. Yes. Uh, my son was uh, working in an organization, Isaac Kuchi. Isaac Kuchi means the International Students Association for Cultural Mingling. He was working there and uh, he bought so many friends of foreigners to our house. Then we were staying at Kochi and after we shifted here, the friends